Hey everybody, thanks for joining us on part one of our epic tuna trip. In this video, we will be trolling offshore of Destin, Florida. Uh, we go about 60 miles out. We're gonna hit the new fads that are out there. These fads are their, they stand for fish attractive devices. Were put out by the county about a year ago. There's eight of them put out between 1,100 and 2,400 feet of water. They're basically big buoys that uh, almost simulate the leg of an oil rig. So far they've been great for holding pelagics such as tuna and mahi. Yeah, I like the one right here. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and check back for part two where we get our tuna. Oh baby, that's a monster dolphin! Alright, let me, uh, you see him? Alright, hold on, let me help you get in the chair.
across this floating crab pot. I saw a nice triple tail under it. Fortunately, only the jacks would hit our line. So we decided to go for a swim and get some underwater footage. Um, only on the surface, hence why I'm so far back. Okay, coming. I got you ready, okay? Guys, we got into this amazing school of dolphin in this beautiful blue water. We just had to go up a cruise with them for a little bit. You can see them all playing around the boat here. It was pretty awesome. So I wanted to show you guys a quick shot of our spread here. Uh, you can really see how far out the Sterling Tackle wide trackers go. Uh, we're actually getting hit by little jacks in this, but you can't really tell. We didn't end up hooking one anyways. Yeah. Well, we 
end up hooking up with one more fish here. Really? And it's getting pretty dark. This was the end of our trolling. And this will be the end of this video. You guys uh, make sure to stay tuned and check back in for the second part where uh, we do a little nighttime swordfish fishing and we don't catch a swordfish, but something just as good. <laughs>